Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we are making a mocktail that can also be a cocktail and it is called the Blushing Apricot. What we are going to do first is I have these really nice silicone molds. I got them on Amazon. If you'd like the link, just let me know. And what we're going to do is we're going to fill that with some apricot nectar. You can find this right near um, in the juice aisle, kind of where you would find pineapple juice um, or cranberry juice. We're going to go ahead and fill the bottom tray of our mold. There is a line that we fill to. And then as we place the top, it's going to press that into our top portion. Any ex excess is going to leak through the top. So you just push that down until they're nice and flush. We're gonna pop these in the freezer until they are all completely frozen. And then this will be the base of our beverage. All right, we're ready to assemble our blushing apricots. My mold is out and I'm going to go ahead and pop the spheres right out. You just push on it, it pops right out. Put it right into your cup. I'll put one in each of them. We're gonna make one of them a mocktail uh, for the kiddos and then a couple for Wayne and I. So what we're going to add right on top is we are going to put a couple droplets of orange bitters. So when you're having it in just a couple drops, it's a non-alcoholic, uh, but don't drink the bottle because if you drink the bottle, it does um, actually contain large, kind of like vanilla extract. So just two drops in each. There we go. We are then going to go ahead, I will do the front one as a cocktail. I'm going to put a shot of vodka in there. This is Honey Crisp Vodka from uh, 1911. Beacon Skiffs. All right. We are then going to top it with Fresca, the uh, grapefruit citrus kind. And then as that apricot sphere melts, it's going to give off some color. And that's where we call it the blushing apricot. On the side, we'll do our couple of it. Give it a quick little stir. And then because it's not seasoned for apricots, they didn't have any, so I'm going to just pop in a orange slice and enjoy. 